face Shanice Millions and today we got a what's in my book bag supply haul okay my back to school supplies for school ignore my blanket because my mama be having it freezing in here like below zero for real this is my book bag right here it is a Michael Kors book bag matter of fact it, it matched the, the watch you see what I'm seeing the watch and the bag matching okay real cute little details that y'all ain't really see but I'm gonna put it out anyway <laughs> if you guys don't know I'm a college student so my bag does not have like a million different composition notebooks and, and all that other crazy folders you know color coordinated folders and all that stuff no it don't got a lot of that in it uh -uh, i'm sorry this is gonna be real quick cute and short okay don't forget to like comment and subscribe make sure you join the team because if you're not a millionaire up here you'll never be a millionaire around here okay let's get into today's video so this book bag was a gift um i've had this for a while since high school you know back in high school you get a new book bag every single year this is college nobody cares that much like put it in the bag and go it's not that serious it's not that serious okay um i've had this book bag for years literal years so and it's done me good like ain't never do me no wrong these pockets on the sides are empty there's nothing in them so it's not really nothing for me to show or, or pull out of there so the first thing i have in my book bag is my glasses case um i wear reading glasses i'm a blind bitch just a little bit i'm gonna try them on for y'all so y'all can see how cute i look with my little glasses on and they're also michael kors i'm a michael kors fiend sorry but um yeah this is me with my glasses on real cute sophisticated uh giving you like shy girl in the corner you know what i'm saying or giving you like sophisticated mommy you know what i'm saying like like who me these are my shades <laughs> but like you know I'm, I'm finna be that real cute girl in the corner that real mysterious girl like uh, you know yeah it's giving Velma just a little bit it's not giving Velma at all it's giving bad bitch sorry baddie period the next thing I have in my book bag are sticky notes. I kind of folded up a little bit because I kind of just threw them in here like I said before the video started. So don't mind me. But um, I have sticky notes. My favorite color is pink. So I have two sets of pink and one um, like neon green color. Baby, sticky notes are going to save your life. Now, I'm not really a big, you know, pencil and paper kind of person. I like writing like key notes down. Like just give me one real important thing I need to know regarding the class or the schedule or a chapter in a book or something and it'll be on my sticky note i don't have time to be writing it down to 10 million different notepads and all that stuff i ain't got time for that the next thing i have in my blue bag are a set of pens colorful pens that i already opened so i could take notes for my other videos for today lol don't worry don't mind me but just some paper made pens now if y'all know y'all know big them big pens really be right in paper made i just got these because they was on sale but them big pens they be doing what they gotta do but you know these work too they get the job done the next thing i have in my book bag are highlighters baby you can never ever go to school without highlighters okay like the notes that i do happen to write down i like to highlight them because that means it's more important how are you going to separate the important information from the non-important information without highlighters like you just need that in your life period um surprisingly i have one mechanic pencil if you know anything about college you know you'll never ever ever write with pencils like black and blue ink only but apparently i have a pencil in here this must be from last year or something i don't know next we have a five star notebook nothing fancy just one because any major notes this one has the um This one has like, well, I thought it had like the, the dividers in it so where I could like separate it that way like I can like, what's those words? Dividers, right? Like the, oh, the tabs, the tabs. This one doesn't have the tabs, but it don't really need the tabs. I'm cool without the tabs. That's what y'all should invest in. If y'all want y'all like a big notebook with like, so you can separate your classes from one another, get the tabs and put them in your notebook so you can separate it. Next thing I have in here is another little clear glasses case. I keep this one just in case I lose the other one because the other one gets kind of dirty. But I also ordered these from Sheen. And I thought these were so ugly, y'all. I'm not gonna lie. I bought these to be cute, like, you know, the real cute aesthetic. But, like, this boy said they were ugly. And I was like, ugh. They, are they ugly, y'all? Like, comment down below in the video. <laughs> comment down below, like, are they ugly? Let me know. Is it giving, like, Steve Urkel? Or is it giving, like, cute, you know, like, classy, like, aesthetic? You know, the look that I'm going for. Y'all know the look I'm going for. Is it giving that? A little bit? no okay all right anyways i plan on using this case as like just a spare glasses case because i have regular glasses like my actual reading glasses that i just showed y'all and i have a pair of sunglasses in that one case and baby it's getting real crowded in here so gotta do what i gotta do next are these two mini five star notebooks i just thought these were so cute like these were just so cute i just could not pass these up and how about it was on clearance i went to walgreens and they were on clearance for 50 cents 
five star notebooks. Y'all know these be like six, seven dollars a piece and run back to school time. I don't know why or what happened or what made these 50 cents, but there was two of them and I had to cop both of them. These are also good for note taking, you know, any little important information that you need, just write down in here and your girl is gonna be good to go. Next is the most important thing of all. Like the most important thing of all. My pink iPad. <laughs> Y'all know I bought this iPad a couple weeks ago. If you haven't seen a video of the unboxing, it'll be right here. And it'll be linked, like, up here. Go check it out. Y'all know y'all want to go see my video of me unboxing my pink iPad because I'm a bad bitch and y'all want to go watch it, period. Anyways, this is what I'm going to be using for the bulk of my, like, assignments, my note-taking. Like, that's why I'm not really too much pressed about having, like, a binder and dividers and folders and all that stuff. I'm not too much worried about the paper trail because college is, like light work and then think about it you only have two and three classes a day there's no reason for me to be carrying around six seven notebooks this is not high school okay everything i need to do is gonna be right on here and like y'all seen my keyboard the keyboard for the ipad is gonna make it like a laptop that way i don't have to carry my laptop with me but um essential I won't go no work out i promise i look so cute and sophisticated with my little ipad and my little glasses on like yeah yeah the next thing I have in my book bag is like just girl essentials, makeup wipes. I can't tell y'all how many times I just need to go redo something. Reapply some makeup, wipe off some makeup, anything. Having like just spare makeup wipes. And these act as like baby wipes or like cleansing wipes to get stuff off your hands. Like, and that's what I recommend too. Get regular like cleansing wipes and hand sanitizer to go in your bag. But that's in my purse and this is my book bag. So for right now, we got makeup wipes and they're going to do the job. The next thing I have in my bag is just some regular hand lotion. As a female, it is important to be up on your hygiene, girl, okay? Keep you some hand lotion. Keep you a little thing of like um, a roll-on perfume or like a little small travel size spray perfume in your bag. It is so important because you never know where you're going to go. You never know when you want to just freshen up a little bit. Keep it in your bag. Keep it in your bag. And the last thing I have in my book bag are pads. And I need to put tampons in here. I don't know why I put pads and not tampons in here. I'm not even a pad girly, but tampons. That's just self-explanatory as a female sometimes your period just start when it start and you just gotta be on your p's and q's you never know when you're gonna be getting it started so make sure you have your emergency kit put together i also have like an emergency kit bag like a bag dedicated to like my emergency needs for back to school so if y'all want to see that video just let me know but it's like just girl essentials just basic girl essentials that you need for your everyday bag so let me know if y'all want to see that video all right y'all that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoy my short but cute back to school supply list don't forget to comment down below we here just comment down below we here like we in the same like team millionaire period i love you guys and i will see you guys next week